Hi everyone, it's Chrissy and welcome back to another Sims 4 video. So today we're actually going to be doing a quick little room build and this build is actually for a challenge. Now this is actually a room challenge that Reese Moon is running over on Twitter and he's actually going to be touring some of these entries on his Twitch stream. So basically this whole challenge is the fact that he built this little corner and it's called the tiny corner, yeah the tiny corner challenge. So basically you have this almost dollhouse style tiny little corner room where two of the like two of the sides don't have any walls. So it's literally like the dollhouse challenge that was floating around the sims community a few years ago where you basically have this like almost like a 3d facade type of thing where you can see in from the like one side of it and only like the back and like the sides have walls if that makes sense but basically you have to take this tiny little corner room and you can turn it into anything you want you can turn it into a tiny little kitchen a bedroom a study a living space whatever you want to do and for some reason i really wanted to build something in this kind of zen yeah almost zen kind of style i don't know how to do, like explain this more modern kind of style that i went for but my whole idea behind this was that i wanted to build with a lot of dark woods a lot of like dark woods black and then a lot of plants that's kind of the idea that i had in my head and I figured what better way to do that, what better room to do that with, I guess I should say, than a bathroom. So we're going to be building a very zen, modern, kind of plant lover's bathroom with this tiny little, like, corner room. And I love the way it turned out. I don't know if it's functional. I don't think the sink would be functional the way I did it here. But it's not really meant to be functional. I don't really care about it being functional. I mean, it's technically not even an enclosed room. So, like, why would I care about it being functional? So, yeah, it's basically all just for aesthetics. And I had a lot of fun with this. I had a lot of fun with just cluttering up a few of the things. And then adding a crap ton of plants. Because, yeah, I wanted this to look like a plant lover's, like almost zen kind of bathroom and i love the way this turned out like i'm using the tub from the snowy escape pack and then i'm using a lot of spa day as well so i'm using like the spa day counters and cabinets i think and then i think the toilet might also be from spa day i'm not exactly sure so don't quote me on that one but yeah, I'm, I'm using just a bunch of different packs because we are allowed to use whatever packs we want so yeah, I'll leave Reese's Twitter and his Twitch where he's going to be touring all of these builds. I'll leave both of those down below. I'll also leave the hashtag that you can use to find his original like corner shell as well as my build. So he's using the hashtag tiny corner challenge I think on the gallery. But I'll leave it in the description and I'll also leave his gallery ID in the description as well. He's a really really great builder. So I would definitely recommend going and checking out his gallery and all of that stuff and then check out his Twitter for the like rules for this challenge in case you want to participate it in participate in it yourself. So yeah, I'll leave all of those like relevant links down below. And yeah, that's basically everything I have to tell you about this room. It turned out to be almost 9000 simoleons, which is really expensive for a bathroom, but again, I didn't really pay attention to like cost or anything like that. And yeah, I'm just, I'm having a lot of fun with these tiny little room builds. For some reason, I'm actually planning on doing at least one other one, another challenge here on the channel this week. Because I'm having fun with these little shorter videos for this week. Because I've started working on the land grab mansion for Oasis Springs for my save file. And yeah, it's big to say the least. I mean, it's on a 50 by 50 lot. So obviously it's going to be really big. And yeah, I think for this week we're gonna stick with some shorter videos, so like some room builds. I already have a creator sim that I have planned, which is going to be another Sims 2 recreation of a Sims 2 family, so that's really cool. And yeah, that's basically everything I have to tell you about, you know, what's going on this week. Like I said, just some shorter videos this week, I think. And yeah, I'm gonna be doing a few more room builds because yeah, I'm having a lot of fun with them and they're kind of nice to do. 
you know, whilst I'm working on this really big mansion. And the mansion will probably be like two parts as well. So like an exterior and interior because... Yeah, it's big. It's it's very big and it's going to take me hours and hours to complete. So yeah, there's that. But we're almost done with this bathroom. I'm just adding a little like like bath shelf kind of thing, which I love the way this looks. And yeah, I'm, I'm basically done with this voiceover. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a like. And if you're new to the channel and you'd like to see some more Sims content, feel free to hit the subscribe button and remember to turn on the notification bell as well to be notified of whenever I upload a new video. But I'll talk to you all in my very next video. Bye everyone.